Texturizer. Yo, what's up? How you doing, everybody? Welcome back to our picture slideshow updates of the river. And then in today's episode, we're staring at Bukosi Shope's house, where Lindy will insist that she's gonna take the Shope family. But the Shopes were afraid that their plan was gonna fail. And they told Lindy that they already bought plane tickets. And Lindy will told them that she will embrace them for their ticket because it's economy. No Mafu told Lindy that it's time for them to meet halfway because she have done a lot. Lindy will told them that she's not compromising because her granddaughter is fragile. And then Lindy will left them and the shopper family was surprised and shocked. And going to Cobra Tuso Mukwena's house, the family was still discussing about Cobra's plan of living alone by going to Angelina. They were arguing that he should go with somebody just because it's not gonna be safe for him to go alone there and Morena was telling his father that he wants to go with him because it was his fault and Dimpo was screaming at Morena telling him that of course it's his fault when Rahari told Dimpo to stop and leave the poor boy alone because it's not the time for blaming each other it's time for them to come together and find a solution and then Munolo came with a plan to call detective Muedi because Angelina won't know the cops are there Rahari wanted to call the cops but Cobra told them to stop and tell them about what Angelina said so Cobra doesn't want any mistakes because he knows how Angelina is so they all told Cobra to be careful because that woman is crazy so Cobra left telling them that he wants to bring Tato alive and moving back to Bukosi Lopez house Lindywe came back with Bangizwe telling them that just to check if everything is okay the Shopper family told her that everything is okay when the Shopper family asked Lindywe if she already sold everything with her banker and Lindywe told them that her banker knows everything that this one is one of top priority because right now Flora is packing her bags as they speak. Kwezi told Lindy that she doesn't think this is necessary because Dr. Mabaso told them that Zanota and will be in isolation so Kwezi will be the only one allowed in and she also wants to be close to her. Lindy told Kwezi that Bangizwe and Andile will come with her. Kwezi told Lindy that even then she'd be able to see her when she is out of isolation. Kwezi told Lindy that she will keep her updated every step of the way and then there was a beep on Lindy Wei's phone and then she told the shopper family that 4 million is in her account right now. All the shopper family started to have smiles on their faces. Especially when Lindy Wei told Kwezi that she will transfer that 4 million into her bank account because she trusts her. And Lindy Wei told Kwezi that she was gonna be comfortable if she took the private jet. Kwezi thanked Lindy Wei for everything that she's doing for her and Zanotando. And then Lindy Wei and Bangizwe left them and go and going back to Tuso Mukwena's house Zoto was still shouting at Cobra telling him that she doesn't want to be selfish and rude but she wants her grandson and she told Cobra to do everything that Angelina said she said she doesn't care even Angelina can tell Cobra to walk on fire she doesn't care Cobra must walk on that fire and bring her grandson home she told Tuso that she never asked him for anything but this is her first time to ask Cobra for something is to bring back her grandson Son, because she can't afford to lose another member of the family and going to Bangizo's home Bangizo was telling his boys that he doesn't have time but he wants his boys to do this for him he told his boys that they need to be very careful and not appear as though as they are poking their noses where they don't belong Bangizo told his boys that this plan of the shop has to take the baby overseas for surgery and all that money that needs to be paid something doesn't add up here this is all planned Bangizo Bangizwe thought this is a scam because he can see it even the biggest stupid can see this. He told them that he can see and tell from how Kwezi spoke that she was told and coached on what to say. That was not all her. He told his boys to do some investigations for him because there's something off about this but they need to make sure that Lindywe doesn't catch wind of this. He told them that he doesn't want them to look like they are here to mess up people's lives but he's actually doing it for her although it's none of his business but he's doing it for Lindy Wei. he told his boys to call him if there's something and going back to the shopper's house the shoppers were about to go overseas while there was Veronica Lindy Wei Bangizwe as well as Bangizwe's boys in the house and Flora came in and told them that they need to pray before taking this journey so they all closed their eyes for a prayer so Flora started her prayer saying God and Father Son of the Holy Spirit we ask you to heal Zanot 
Notando and give her a long life. When they are still praying, Bangizwe opened his eyes and looking at Shope, while Shope was opening his eyes looking at Bangizwe as well as Lindiwe. Lindiwe was looking straight into Bukosi Shope's eyes while Flora was continuing with her prayer. The Shopes thank Lindiwe again for her kindness, telling her that they were grateful they don't know where they'd be without her. And Lindiwe told them to travel safe and give a kiss to the baby for her and then everybody left and going to the house in the bush cobra parked his car and went to that house while angelina was inside that house with the baby when angelina was telling the baby that at least his father is smart cobra went inside that house when angelina pulled out a knife and point the knife at cobra and cobra asked angelina what's the knife for because she told him to come alone and he already did that so what's up with the knife angelina told him she's not gonna stab him if he can do what she says when cobra was begging Angelina to put the knife down for them to talk. Angelina told Cobra to take off his jersey. Cobra took off the jersey and Cobra told Angelina that he's got no wire with him. Angelina pointed Cobra with a knife and told him to handcuff himself right on the table and Cobra did what Angelina was telling him. He handcuffed himself on the table and then Cobra was asking Angelina what does she want. Back to Lindiwe's house, Lindy was sitting alone when she was being joined by Flora. When Lindy was asking Flora if she doesn't have work in the house. Flora told Lindy with that she's done with ironing and all other chores. When Flora was starting to talk about Zanotando, Lindy told Flora that she just need peace and quiet. Flora apologized to Lindy and left her. And going to Refilwe, Paco Beauty and others were at the beauty salon when Dimpo came in running telling them that her brother is in trouble and his phone is off. Dimpo told them everything about Angelina. Paco told them that they can't just act hastily they need to come down and see what's gonna happen he told them they need to go out and spread out and they will find him and moving to the shoppers the shoppers were on their way to the hotel that they booked when Kanyiso was pushing Kwezi's baby pram and Nomafu as well as Bukosi and Kwezi were following going to the hotel and they were being welcomed to luxury stay lodge hotel and they started to enjoy the comfort of the hotel when they came in when Nomafu was still praising Kwezi for convincing Lindiwe's pilot to bring them here. Bukosi told his daughter that this is a beautiful place. This is the best heist ever and there was no blood spilt and no one died and he told them to bring glasses together for Kwezi. While Kwezi wasn't feeling comfortable about this looking at her child and moving back to Refilwe. Morena was sitting on the stone by the street while detective Mueti parked the car next to him and detective told Morena that they will find Tuso and Morena's brother and the detective was still asking Morena if Angelina phoned Tuso and gave a location asking him why they didn't call the police. He told them they had to do what she said because she says no cops. Morena told detective Moeti to do her job and moving back to that house in the bush. Cobra was starting to complain at Angelina telling her that he's been sitting here for hours. Angelina told Cobra to shut up because he's stressing the baby. Cobra was asking Angelina what does she want from him. Angelina told Cobra to calm down. Angelina told Cobra she wants them to be fine. She told Cobra that him and her have been through a lot and after this nothing will ever shake them again. She said by the time they walk out of this door they need to be fine. Be a husband and wife again and fix this. She pulled a knife again and tell Cobra that they need to be fine. This is the end. Thank you very much for watching and please don't forget to like and subscribe on this channel to see what's gonna happen up next and see you on the next episode. Thank you for watching Sterizer TV teasers and please subscribe and hit the bell to be always updated about the latest TV updates.